tired of second-rate bottom-of-the-barrel barrels? Then come on down to Bluster Barrel Works. Sales extravaganza, because at Bluster Barrel Works, we've got the competition over a barrel. It's bad enough I can't get gator wrestling, but now I have to listen to this blabbering butthead baboon instead. Oh, why must my world be littered with such homespun idiots? Morning, King Grulza! Speaking of which... The secret weapon is repaired and ready for its first test launch. I was thinking of volunteering. Uh, Crusher! Oh. Uh, he must still be watching Sing Along with Uncle Swampy, his favorite TV show. What? Uncle Swampy rates number one every week. A million viewers can't be wrong. A million viewers. That's it. I'm going to be on television. On the Sing Along with Uncle Swampy show? No, you lunkhead. I'm going to invade the television airwaves. They're in front of everybody in TV land, I claim my rightful place as new ruler of Congo Bongo Island. <laughs> <laughs> uh, how? I'm going to steal the crystal coconut on national television. <laughs> uh, how? My lips, you idiot! With the secret weapon! Oh! Oh, yeah! <laughs> Will you get out of here and get to work? Prepare the secret weapon for immediate transport! Whilst I prepare for my television debut. Well, doing commercials was a lousy idea, Candy. Sales are still way down. If you recall, my idea didn't include you in the commercial. And what's wrong with me? Nothing. Except no one believes you. Which is why I got somebody else to help sell your barrels. For free. Someone we all know and love. I got Cranky. That old fossil. But if Cranky says your barrels are the best, sales will skyrocket. I knew you'd like it. So I already made all the arrangements. And who knows, Candy? You might even get a promotion for this. Unless you mess this up. So don't! Mummy wouldn't like that. Don't worry, I've got everything under control. I certainly hope so. It's your job on the line if Cranky doesn't show. Wow, Candy, is it true? Did you really get Cranky to agree to be in Bluster's next commercial? Yeah, and this could mean really big things for my career, DK. Never felt so alive. I'm a move around and shake it with a jump and time. Hey, diddle diddle, forget about the middle. Take me to the top, cause I finally arrived. Watch out down below. I'm a wheeling and a dealing like a CEO. See me shout, I feel like busting out. There's no telling how far I could go. Bull by the horns, tiger by the tail. Get out of my way, I got barrels for sale. Don't you see that I'm second to none? Look out, world, cause here I come! Ooh, swingin', baby. The world's my oyster, can't you see? Everything's growing exponentially. There's so much opportunity for a one-woman advertising factory. Never felt so alive. I'm a mover and a shaker with a jump and drive. Hidey, hidey, ho, and a schooly beep bop. I'm just like cream. I'm rising to the top. The future's so bright that I gotta wear shades. Look out, baby, I got it made. Don't you see that I'm second to none? Look out, world, cause here I Anything I can do to help? Yeah, make sure Cranky's ready. I'll be by to pick him up shortly. You can count on me, Candy. At Bluster Barrel Works, we've got the competition over a barrel. Yeah, 
I can't believe I let Candy talk me into helping Bluster sell his barrels. Calling all seniors! Roll into those rockers and fade your knuckles down to Congo Bongo's Rockerama Heavy Metal Drunk Karaoke Guitar and Campus! Yeah! Rock and roll! Rock and roll! Hey, Cranky, what's all the screaming? You okay? Cranky? Uh, Cranky? <laughs> Get oh. the wind out of him, DK! Oh. Quick! Give him some water! Oh. 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 Here! Got him to stop singing. Yeah, I mean, it's not like he has to go anywhere. <gasps> Blusters! The TV commercial! Oh, no! Candy promised that Cranky would be there! Yoo-hoo, ah! Cranky! You all set to go? I'll keep her busy. You hide, Cranky. Hey, Candy. How's it hiding? I mean, going. Great, TK. Is Cranky here? Nope, no way. I'm all alone. What was that? Mice. Mice? <laughs> DK, you're such a kidder. Yeah, well, uh, Kenny, no, wait! Oh, uh, I can explain. Explain what? Huh? Explain why Cranky's not here. He's getting a haircut. Yeah, getting a haircut. What's that? Mice? With allergies. Come on, get serious. Actually, <coughs> oh, oh, it's just me. <coughs> well, if you see Cranky... I'll be sure to send him to Blusters. See ya, bye. Holy, that was close. I almost didn't get Cranky out the back door in time. Cranky doesn't have a back door, little buddy. He does now. Uh, you think he'll be mad? Not as mad as Candy's gonna be when she finds out I've messed up her whole career. Ah, don't sweat it, DK. We could get Cranky to Blusters in time for the TV commercial. You're right. So, where'd you put him anyway? <laughs> I laid him down on one of the footbridge traps. That wasn't such a good idea, little buddy. Well, neither was setting off the trigger barrels, big buddy. We gotta get Cranky to Blusters. We gotta find him first. Cranky! I can feel my bio rhythms jamming. My horoscope says a mysterious force is gonna bring me ancient relics from unknown places. Cranky! Jump back, dude! Cranky landed in Funky's biplane. This is great! All we have to do now is hook up with Funky, then bring Cranky over to Blusters. Uh-oh. That sounds like a bad uh-oh. What about the crystal coconut? If Cranky finds out we left it alone, we're as good as furless. But if we don't get Cranky back, then good things aren't gonna happen for Candy, and it'll be all my fault. Somebody's gotta watch it for us. But who? Hey, dudes! DK, what's up? Operation Steel, the Crystal Coconut, attempt number 307. Commencing, sir. No one's even there. We can just walk right in and steal it. Oh, spoken like a true amateur, huh? Where I come from, we do things with style, drama, flair. I mean, just taking it? How's that going to make me look? I'll be on television. All of Congo Bongo will be watching. I'm not a common cat burglar. I'm a grand dictator who's about to cleverly wrestle the power away from those mindless monkeys. Don't you see? Um, uh, is that a trick question? Oh, never mind. Just make sure that secret weapon is ready on my signal. Uh, and a clump. If we run into any problems, whatever you do, don't go blabbing them on national television. Ooh, 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 ooh. I, I could use my secret emergency code. Like, the fog was thick and dense. Like your brain. N no, 
Uh, it means the air is thick with enemies. Get it? Well, cold talk. Also, no one will understand me. That's a given of the best of times, Clump. Now shut up and stand by for my signal. I'm going live! The wheels on the mine car go round and round, round. Hey, what happened to Uncle Swampy? Hello there, TV land. In mere moments, I, King Karul, will be the new ruler of Congo Bongo Island by virtue of my newly stolen possession, the Crystal Coconut. Stealing is bad. However, to prove that I'm not your average dictator, but rather a barbarian of distinct class and sophistication, I'd like to invite you, the TV viewer, to witness my cordial overthrow of your island. So, stay tuned. Well, where's Cranky? I was told he was on his way. But he should have been here by now. Oh, what should we do? We? No, no, no. This is your problem. So if I were you, I'd hunt down that old grouch and get his wrinkled carcass down here pronto. I don't understand. Frankie knows how important this is to me. Where could he be? I couldn't agree more, Relic Dude. Like I always say, if your two zones glide, then glide the zone. With Dixie watching the coconut, all we gotta do is get cranky back Dixie, and we hold. Stop! I thought you were sending Cranky over to Blusters after his haircut. Where is he? Getting a manicure? At the doctor's? Huh? He's getting a manicure at the doctor's. Yeah, it's a new uh, manicure, medicure, uh, procedure thingy. It's very new. So new they don't even know it yet. But don't worry, Candy. I got a feeling he's gonna be showing up real soon. Tag, you're it. What the? What's going on around here? around here somewhere. Uh, enemy headquarters in range. Uh, target clearly visible. Uh, huh? An intruder. This is just the kind of problem King Karul said we might run into. I'd better alert him. El Pronto. And how am I planning to steal the coconut? Well, my friend, that's where my genius comes into play. Sir, stick up. Sir, the goose is loose. Not now, clump. But, sir, the, the oven is overheating. You're in my closer. The baby's bicycle is broken. You'll be broken if you don't stop interrupting me. Don't. I don't know what you two are up to, but if I don't find Cranky, I'm in big trouble! I knew it. Where is he? I'm sure Cranky's trying to get there as fast as he can. He better be. But, sir, the fuzzy little lamb, you... Shut up! And get the secret weapon ready! How'd he get in there? <sighs> Who cares? Just get rid of him! Great! He's exactly where we want him! Uh, almost! Another word! First you said Frankie's getting a haircut, then you said he was on his way, then he was at the doctor! I wanna know where Frankie is! So do I! Buster, I... Oh, save 
it, Candy. If Cranky isn't here by the time we go to air, you're fired! <laughs> Why would Cranky do this to me? Where could he be? Candy, I'm so sorry. No, DK, I'm sorry. This whole thing has made me crazy. I've been trying to win success at the risk of losing everything else, including my friends. I was blinded by ambition when I lost my inhibition. Now suddenly I'm wishing to be back where I belong. In the advertising rat race at a crazy frenzied pace. I was taken full advantage and that's where I went wrong. Then you're not where you're at Then you know you've gone too far I was stepping on my friends I would ridicule and offend I didn't mean to condescend Forgive my foolish pride I couldn't see the jungle for the trees The business brought me to my knees You gotta learn how to cheat and scam and lie Just remember you ain't and you're not where you're at then you know you've gone too far just remember who you are it's never too late to set yourself straight self-respect will make you a star i'm sorry dk i've done nothing but accuse you and given you grief and it's not even your fault. Look, Candy, I can't explain things right now, but I promise that I'm gonna find Cranky and have him here in time for Bluster's next commercial. Really? It's a guarantee. Oh, DK, you've never let me down before. I just know you won't let me down now. I'll go tell Bluster. How could you make a promise like that? Because I started this mess and I'm gonna fix it. We gotta catch up with that express mail rocket ship! Lester's chopper! In closing, I'd like to say that it will be my extreme pleasure to dictate over you. And I hope your enslavement is completely distressing. <laughs> and now, I present to you a secret weapon! Notice its fine contours. Will and you just get inside? The rocket ship! There it is! And there he goes! The crank is headed for Purple Wolf Mine! I got an idea, but I need your help. That's what sidekicks are for. Good. You drive. What? Ah, I can't drive! Neither can I. <laughs> Take the wheel. Clump will now launch himself out of the secret weapon and steal the crystal coconut, thereby declaring me as the new ruler of Congo Bongo. In other words, I win. Hang on, Cranky. Almost there. Whoa! That had to hurt. And it did. Okay, enough monkeying around. Sorry, Cranky, but I promised Candy to get you the blusters, and that's where you're going. What? Bluster, that works. 
because your battles have been around forever? And I should know, because so have I? What kind of crack is that? <laughs> you heard it here, folks. This is Bluster from Bluster's Metalworks signing off, saying... Hey, what happened to King Karool? <laughs> Crusher, repair the problem. Ten four, soldier. The eggs are fried. Uncle Swampy always says bye bye. Is everything okay? Couldn't be better. Bluster's mom is so happy with the way things turned out that Bluster wants to promote me. Wow! That's fantastic, Candy! Yeah, but I'm not interested. Why not? Don't you want really great things to happen to you? Yes, to me. Why should I waste all my good ideas on Bluster? Besides, I'm thinking of something less stressful. To be honest, this TV stuff is just a big pain. Oh, speaking of pain, why am I in so much of it? Last thing I remember, I was gasping for air when you handed me a bottle. Uh, little buddy, I'm way 